everyone, welcome back to my channel, but if I have never met you yet, hello, my name is Kimia. I am so excited to have you joining us here in Kimmy's Closet. If you want to stick along for the ride, make sure to subscribe and turn on that bell notification button so you can be notified every time that I upload a video. I typically like to do fashion and sometimes beauty, but don't look at my... Don't look at my bronzer, I got ready in a rush day. <laughs> this is one of my favorite hauls that I've done in a while because I think I love every single item and I'm so excited to share it with you. So if you want to see what I'm adding into my wardrobe for I believe the upcoming season, there's a mix, there's some spring stuff, there's some winter stuff, then keep on watching this video. This is what I'm gonna start off with, I've already worn it. I wanted this before Black Friday and I was like, Kimia, just wait, it's probably gonna go on sale and I waited a month, they did go on sale, they came like 50% off. I don't have a square toe, this is like an almondy square toe um, heel in my closet and I love the skinny heel. It's just everything about it I really like and they're not uncomfortable. I wore this twice already and they're not super uncomfortable. I feel kind of weird walking in them because the heel is kind of skinny and I'm scared I'm gonna get caught in cobblestone and like fall face, face down <laughs> on cobblestone but so far so good. It's something you can dress up or dress down and I think that they're super cute with like light denim and a big blazer or um, like skinny jeans and a big sweater. Just like very versatile, um, easy to pair with things and a new color in my shoe collection next item I've also worn already and I love so much it's so cute <laughs> I got this little structured bag there's something about this that just like it looks vintage but it looks modern and new and I love things like that I love structural pieces that look um, unique and interesting and this one does that for me I have left the strap in there yeah, so I haven't worn the strap yet, but you can attach the strap and like wear it crossbody. But because the the little strap doesn't come off, I feel like that just looks awkward and it like sits weird on your body. So I just wore it like this. I got a ton of compliments. I wore it to my office Christmas party. And this is something that I know I'll use for next fall and winter as well. But this color is also gonna be a big color for next year. So it's gonna be an easy accessory to pair with my neutrals. Next, I did not need this, but for some reason I got it. Um, <laughs> All right, <laughs> this um, shape of bag is my favorite because I can just easily put what I need in there just like that. And I do like that I can change the strap because this color red, it's like a, it's a red, but it's kind of like a brownish burgundy. It's not the easiest to pair with everything. So I think if I can get my hands on a simple chain, then I'll take this one off and put the simple chain and then I can wear this to go out or really dress it up or dress it down. Next, if you watched my last video, you would have seen the sweater on already, um, but I got this big chunky knit, super soft, let me tell you, this is not itchy at all, sweater. I just love this. I really thought about it. I was like, Kimia, you don't need this, but maybe you do. Love it so much. I feel like a big marshmallow in it. It's something that, you know, it feels like pajamas, but it it's dressed up <laughs> and this is something that I'll wear a lot a lot and if you did watch my last video one of my most worn items of 2019 was like this big cowl neck um, oversized sweater and I think this is gonna replace that just because it's so simple I can wear it for any kind of occasion in winter next I got something I did not need I got this cropped blazer the color is something I'm not used to I don't really have this color gray just because I don't know if it suits me all that well but I just love this I love that it's cropped I love that you can tie it at the waist um, I think I can do this with my camel boots and then just like slouchier jeans which I don't have I don't have slouchier jeans I'll just wear my basic blue Levi's and have it be like a kind of dressed up sophisticated look but I did really like this and because it's kind of more of like a a trendier item I didn't want to pay full price for it so I think it's a good thing to get on sale and it is really cute like you can wear it um, open maybe with some tape so it doesn't like whoo <laughs> and like some jewelry and dress it up um, or I can just wear it with like a white t-shirt and jeans and black like combat boots and dress it down I know I'll wear it but I won't wear it as much as like for example the white oversized sweater um, but I do really like it and I'm excited to play around with my style next I have a piece that I've already worn I actually got this a little while ago I just like never shared it but I love it so much and I want you guys to get your hands on it if you like it I love texture that is something that I always always look for especially at Zara a place that sells 
a lot of items. I think texture is your differentiating point of things that look a little bit more elevated or expensive. Some of their items look really, really cheap and they're not even like that cheap. Like you're better off going to like Target. But some of their items I think look more expensive than they are. So this is one of them. My hair gets caught in it all the time. I think it's an item that I can wear year round. It's so cute. It's see-through, but the front is um, lined so you can wear no bra with it, which is what I did. I got the smallest size and extra small and it just keeps everything in and the sleeves are so cute and poofy and I think it has a cute neckline it's like it's not full-on sweetheart but it's like square sweetheart you know and then I got a shirt that looks like it's for someone who is pregnant <laughs> but very comfortable I wore this already as well I wore it for school and it's just like an easy big big piece it's huge this is an extra small and it's massive um but that means it's super comfortable i literally feel like i'm wearing a nightgown in it i got this during the black friday sale i will wear this a lot i know that i will because it's so easy to throw on but it does kind of remind me of like a hospital gown um in like the chicest way <laughs> I would say this is the only item I'm unsure about. I wanted this before it went on sale, but after it went on sale and I got it, I was like, I don't know. It's very 80s. I think that's what is kind of throwing me off. It has like poofier sleeves, but not over the top sleeves. The fabric is this fake satin. Um, and it has these big flowers that are multicolor all over it. I think it's pretty. I think the price was good. I think this was like $25. This is a one-time wear, which I guess for the price is a good thing. It was $25 so I can wear it once for like a birthday or some kind of like party or event for somebody that always seems to pop up and I'm always like, what do I wear? So it's good that I have this in my wardrobe, but it's not... I don't think it's my favorite piece. It fits fine. Um, I just don't feel my best in it. It's just not an everyday practical item, which I have a hard time buying unless it's an accessory because I'm like, I'm only gonna wear this once. What's the point? That was everything from Zara. I'm gonna move on to and other stories now. I picked up this belt. This is a genuine leather belt. It caught my eye and it was the last one, so I picked it up, but Sometimes I'm like, I don't know if wide belts are for me, but at the same time, I don't have a wide belt and I think that they can be really cute with like knit sweaters if you have maybe a long knit dress. Okay, I'm, I'm doing an awful job of showing you what this is gonna look like. I love the rich chocolate color. I kind of wish it didn't have the croc embossed, but I do also think the croc embossed adds something. I just don't think I have the perfect outfit in mind with it yet, which makes me like question it. Next, I have a blouse that you would have already seen if you watched, um, I think my everyday makeup routine. It's a super trans seasonal item. I can wear this for the fall and I can wear it during the spring, um, which is something that I love. And if you watch my videos, I'm not gonna repeat it. You know that I love that. But something like this, so cute. You can dress it up, dress it down. I love that it has its own little like lining on the inside um it's not see-through i didn't wear a bra with it but like if you get cold yeah your nips kind of show but like just it's fine <laughs> i've been really into this cream color i have a shirt from reformation coming up next <laughs> i hunted this blouse down they were sold out on reformation thought about it so so much i think it's a similar style to an orsund iris blouse but those blouses are like $555. So Reformation decided to make their own little version. It's this gorgeous silk blouse. If you have seen my birthday outfit, I wore a dress like this, um, but this is like half the dress basically. So the back is exposed, not something I'll be wearing at school, but it's so gorgeous. I haven't tried it on yet because it's too pretty and I'm scared I'm gonna ruin it. I bought it from Net-A-Porter and it was my first Net-A-Porter item, something that I will wear for like a date night or um, just something more dressed up. My only issue is because it's not lined and I can't wear a bra with it, I don't know if you can see my like wonky tatas. Next, I got a brown sweater by Nanushka. It has these beautiful buttons that look handcrafted. They're like little marble buttons and they're not each identical, which I think is really fun and interesting, but it's definitely not something that catches the eye immediately. Um, I just love this. I love Nanushka. They are one of my favorite brands hands down because their pieces are so fun. I hope I'm really painting a picture for you like this. <laughs> Kimmy up. <laughs> this is a matching set. It comes with um, pants, but the pants are like $400 and they look like pajamas and I'm like, mm, no. I love that it's like bigger and comfortable, but it still looks elegant and like put together and I just love it so much. I don't own a brown sweater. I don't own anything that's like brown. 
I have spice color things, but I don't own chocolate brown items. And I just wanted to add some brown to my wardrobe and this piece was really talking to me and it called me out and I was like, all right, fine, I'll get you. Just stop following me on the ads. <laughs> and it has these little slits. It kind of shows the hip as well so you don't look super like frumpy if that makes any sense. I'm gonna show you something that I am beyond excited about. I love, love, love this so much. You are either going to love it and be like, oh my God, so cute. Or you're gonna be like, are you stupid? <laughs> like, why did you buy this? <laughs> so excited. Um, it is by the brand Medea. When you see it, you'll know. Okay, so it comes in this box. Super cute. I already like unpacked it and then repacked it because I was so excited and I wanted to take good care of it. Wait until you see it. It's so cute. I don't know if this is stupid, but I love it so much. <laughs> it looks like a little shopping bag, um, but it's a leather purse. It has a magnetic clasp. So small, but I can fit my necessities in there. I can fit my phone in there and my wallet um, and maybe like a lipstick or two. Are you dying? Because I am. First off, I was looking at this for quite some time, but in like a lighter eggshell color. And then that lighter eggshell color sold out and I was like heartbroken and I'm like, I still want it. And then I was looking at this one and it was saying last few in stock. That, that part of e-commerce always gets me. Like last one in stock, last few in stock. And I'm like, Ugh. damn you e-commerce, you got me good. So freaking cute. I am genuinely excited about this. Um, I know it's like a trendier item. I know it's not the most practical, but this is the strap and you can tie it on the inside. I'm not going to I'm not going to do the strap because honestly, I'm just going to wear it like this. It looks like a little gift bag. I love like unique little accessories and I think that this is a unique little accessory. It's a fun conversational piece. I have no guilt whatsoever because I was like, you know what? Treat yourself. This was my own present to myself for getting straight A's all semester. So yay for us. We got this and a pair of shoes that was also part of my good job for getting straight A's. <laughs> I feel like I work very hard in school and I'm allowed to treat myself once in a while. You're gonna die, cause I literally am dying. Um, <laughs> Look at how cute these are. I got these little, I'm literally yelling. This is what happens when no one's in the apartment because I full on just yell and my true spirit comes out. I got these adorable little sandals for 50% off. So cute. I don't have a heel like this whatsoever. These are surprisingly so comfortable. I only tried them on at home um, and I haven't walked in them, but like with your first foot going in, I'm just like, oh my God, I'm Cinderella. <laughs> <laughs> They're so comfortable. It barely has any height, which is good because that makes it more comfortable. Um, this little portion being wider feels like feels like there is no height. And then the front is a square toe. It's a square toe sandal, um, which means like your feet aren't being pressed. So these are actually quite comfortable. I'll give you an update once I actually wear them. These are for the springtime. I cannot wear these right now. I cannot wear these for like the next couple of months. And they had a couple different styles. They had one that was snakeskin, but I love this one. I love that it's like this dark blue um, paired with this like lizard kind of scaly print. And then it has a little bow. This is gonna be like a sandal but better shoe for every outfit in the spring and summer. And I'm so stoked about it. They're just so cute. And my feet don't look massive in them, which is a shocker. Cause I have size eight feet and I'm like 5'3". Um, and it kind of looks clownish sometimes with some shoes, but these ones, oh, so excited. Just so you know, Stodd, the owner, used to actually work for Reformation, but she left and she started her own line. So if you see me buying Stodd, I it's because I love them. <laughs> we are back to clothing. I got three items by Anina Bing. Um, first is this chunky cable knit gray sweater. I love the sleeves. I definitely gravitate towards Anina Bing items because her stuff is very practical and like everyday chic pieces, which I think is a really good thing if you're like building your wardrobe, like my holiday sweater, I guess. <laughs> People's holiday sweaters are like colorful. I literally get like a gray basic cable knit sweater for the holidays. And then I got this matching slip. Um, it's not matching, but it's like the exact same color. This slip skirt, which is so pretty, so nice for fall and winter. Um, definitely a really nice piece. I wear one of my slip dresses so, so much. So I know I'll get my wear out of this skirt as well. Um, the only issue is it's kind of cold. <laughs> Slip dresses can be very cold, but I think it's gorgeous. I'm gonna pair these two together. The last clothing item is this Anina Bing 
t-shirt it looks like a band tee but it just says Bing people are just gonna think I'm a big Chandler Bing fan which I am <laughs> and there is a big tiger on it I really wanted the white one but they didn't have they didn't have the white one so I just got this one and that is everything for the clothing and I almost forgot I also got this during Black Friday it's a little bit tangled um, not everything was Black Friday, just so you know. I literally got that t-shirt like yesterday. Um, but I got this beautiful green necklace from Miss Selma just to add, add to my new collection. Um, it's so pretty and I, I'm gravitated towards this green right now. So I got this, definitely something I'll continue to wear. I'm already obsessed with it. I wear it all the time since I got it. So we love this. That is everything that is new in my wardrobe. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below your favorite item and your least favorite item. I want to know so, so bad. Um, so comment that down below, please. And like this video if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't. And turn on your bell notifications if you haven't. Follow me on Instagram if you haven't. This is an annoying goodbye. Hope that you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye everyone.